So I talked to one farmer today who said their fields are soaked and saturated. At the Sessions family farm in Grand Bay, water might be needed to grow produce, but at this point, too much of anything is a really bad thing. The amount of rain came at the wrong time and it's just We'll be lucky to have anything. Jeremy Sessions and his family own their namesake farm. They've been tending to this land in Grand Bay for about eight decades. We're used to having rainfall, you know, this time of year, uh, typical showers, but, you know, this, we've had several rain events where you get five and six inches at a time in a half a day, uh, and those are abnormal. The Fox 10 News Storm Tracker team says this year has already been a wet one. So far, we're nearly a foot of rain above normal. At the Sessions Farm, they're set to harvest some tomatoes, cantaloupe, and watermelons in the next week. All are feared to be ruined because of the excessive rain and disease. These type of rain events cause people to go out of business. It will absolutely break you. Um, you know, you catch two of these years back to back, and there's no, there's, you just can't overcome it. While many farmers are fed up, people who live nearby are also hoping for a break. I enjoy the rain. I just don't enjoy it this much. Um, I enjoy it whenever it comes down, helps you sleep, but uh, it also messes up everything too. As produce gets lost, more will have to be sourced from outside the area, which Session says will affect you at home because it could drive up the price. Live in Mobile tonight, Tyler Finger, Fox 10 News.